damn it. This is why we don't eat tacos right before the video. It's Taco Thursday. That's not a day. It's you definitely say it's not a it's day. It's definitely Tuesday. Pretty sure it's a day right now. <laughs> That's a technicality at best. The universe still says it's a day. <laughs> I thought you were prepping for a fart right there. I thought that's no, a big setup for a. I'm not gonna tell you. <laughs> There's few surprises in life. <laughs> There's few surprises on these videos. This week's is gonna be a surprise fart. Hey yo! Just comment below when you hear it. Okay. Uh, it's Thursday. I'll do our thing first. Here we go. Okay. Hey, hey internet. internet! Uh it is Thursday, October I hate that so much. Thursday, October third, fourth? It is Thursday, October fourth. Third. <sighs> Can't hear anymore. It is Thursday, October third. What does hearing have to do with thinking? What's hearing got to do? What's hearing got, got to, to do, do with it? Got to do with it! What's hearing? But a second-hand sense that I'm using. <laughs> <laughs> so oh, that was better, actually. Uh, I put it into your ears, Internet. Those don't count as parts. Uh, it is Thursday, October 3rd. Tomorrow, of course, being Friday, October 4th, a new release Friday. And we're bringing back something that we used to do uh, a couple months ago. Br a little video where we go over... Was that it? Yeah. Well, no, no. Uh, no. You stumbled, so I was stumbling with you. Oh, I... You stumble, I stutter. I thought I heard a... No, no, okay. I told you, you won't know when it's coming. So, okay. Uh, a little thing we're trying to bring back, which is, of course, a video where we... We, we recap... <laughs> this is a terrible start. We recap uh, some of the new stuff that goes out each Friday here at Dark Side Records. Uh, new release Friday, as it's called. Uh, and we're going to do them on Thursdays now, because Fridays just never seem to work. So we're doing it on Thursday night, so you can uh, catch up. You can get a little sneak peek of what's coming out, a little, uh, a little taste of the gooch, just a little, a little whiff. A taint of the gooch. <laughs> the tiniest taint of the gooch. This video, whole video is tainted already. Uh, tainted love. In, in a little video that we like to call the New Release Roundup. Yeah! <laughs> So, uh, thank you for watching, as always. Uh, you can leave your comments below. Let us know what you're excited about. Now, uh, we normally do a, a video on Monday night where we go over our you stuff. Unlike that video, no dibs in this video. No dibs. You can uh, sort of dib by pre-ordering things you see on this video. Chris, well, Chris McCormick already called dibs. Ah, on who? Me or him? I don't know. You gotta be specific. As we always say Mondays. Probably Drewski. Be specific. Um, you can pre-order stuff you see on our website, and everything you see here you can pick up tomorrow morning, Friday. We open at 10 a.m. here at 611 Dutchess Turnpike in Poughkeepsie, or on the web at darksiderecords.com. Uh, so you can come get this and a whole bunch more. We're just going to give you a little taste. Um, and that's all I got. Oh, Chris McCormick dibbed both of us. Yeah. Eiffel Tower! <laughs> I call Francis. Because I alone love you. <laughs> it's live. Throwing Copper. Mm. The classic live record. This was like the big one. Because, mm -hmm. of course, Mental Jewelry mm -hmm. opened with Pain Lines by the Riverside, but it never really made it. But then you get to I alone. And... No? Nobody? Sorry, I'm not into Christian rock bands that thinly veiled themselves to be 90s alternative rock bands. Boom. But it is a classic album. Want wants of the you internet. You can't. <laughs> hey, look, I can't front on that shit. This is a goddamn classic. It's live. Uh, what was the other big song on this record? Uh, oh, Lightning Crashes. Right, about the baby. And you can sell the drama. Mm -hmm. And it's got three unreleased tracks on it. It's the 25th anniversary edition here on Double LP. Coming out tomorrow morning. Tag team. Back again. Check in the mix and let's begin. Okay. I, I don't know anymore. Oh, party on, party people. Let me hear some noise. DC's in the house. Jump, jump, rejoice. Leave your favorite line. John Gorman. <laughs> Gorman wrote, 
sick burn <laughs> of the cross. <laughs> That's the best corporate joke in a while. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <sighs> also out this uh, Friday, Stranger Things Season 3. Of course, True. they just released the teaser for Season Bring 4. Bring me 11. Uh, and uh, this is the score. They released the soundtrack a couple weeks back on vinyl. It's great. And uh, so not only is it the score, not only is it on a double LP, it is on an indie exclusive Firework that's clear with a whole bunch of colors all splattering out all over the place uh, and You could uh, pick up the score on a 2LP and if you really want to score <laughs> Come take your picture oh, God <laughs> Drew don't go with this cardboard cut out of 11 and post it online and uh, There's a prize of some sort right? I can't remember what the prize is you get this Oh yeah, you get this. Okay, well, she's gonna stay over here now. Okay. Yeah. Great. Stay. All right. Stay in your room, Eleven. <laughs> Leave your door open three inches. S M metaphor for season four? Speaking of joy, it's the new one from Wilco. Indie record store champions fucking Wilco. The new record, Ode to Joy, Out Tomorrow, CD, LP. Of course, it's Jeff Tweedy and the boys back again. <laughs> Not to give a hop again. Gonna, I'm sorry. That's it. Can you slow it down and really folkify it a bit for the Wilco <laughs> release? If we get a uh, hundred likes on this video, I will sing a folk version of uh, Who Let the Dogs Out <laughs> on this video. You heard me, internet. Get to it. Get clicking. Of course, you did mention these guys are uh, indie store darlings, and this is an indie exclusive press oh, of sorry. this album, and it's on pink vinyl. I would have maybe put it on like white, but that's me. I would say uh, pink is more joyous than white. Oh, I, I mean, I'll agree with you there. Yeah. Speaking of songs from the big pink, <laughs> Tyler, the creator. New album, or I guess I would say most recent album, Igor, finally out this week on vinyl. Finally. Uh, it is on Black LP. You you know the deal. It's Tyler, the creator. This is definitely the Drumadon Milosevic pick of the week, for sure. So, tomorrow morning, come get it. Have you seen Eleven in the background of our video? Oh, yeah. Look at your screen. Ugh. It's pretty good. <laughs> you put her more in the foreground? Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, well, slip of the tongue here. <laughs> it's White Snakes, slip of the tongue. Of course, featuring Steve Vai on your wheelie squealies. And uh, what anniversary we got this? The 30th anniversary deluxe edition includes remasters, B sides, and alternate versions on 180 grams of pure petroleum. You know what I just learned? Steve Vai was in White Snake. I wanted to quote that uh, Bowling for Soup song where he said something about on the hood of White Snake's car. Uh, 1985. Yes, man. Uh, wrong band. <laughs> anyway, White Snake, 30th anniversary. Slip it in. That's right. Also out this week, uh, I'm going to do a, a batch here. It's a twosome, both out this week on Relapse Records. Wait, the new was those in my pile? You switched them? <laughs> Slip of the tongue, slight of the hand. A uh, new one from Exhumed, and a new one from Gate Creeper. Uh, Gate two Creeper! Great metal bands out this week. Just want to show you, because they are, of course, indie exclusives. They are from Relapse, which means you'll be able to get them on a super cool limited colored vinyl. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Oh, look at that. Look how cool that is. So, what do, you, what do you think? If you like metal... It's, this is actually not that different than the firework colored uh, Stranger Things thing that's also out this week. Or uh, fireworks ice cream mm. at like Stewart's. Mm. Or what my toilet looks like afterwards. Ugh. Mm. You're eating too many runts. <laughs> <laughs> Next up for me, brah, 
It's, uh, God, this must, what year did this come out? 2001, 2002, something like it's that? It's probably on the back. 2004. 2004. Beastie Boys. To the five burras. That's right, kookaburras. Mm -hmm. To the five <laughs> kookaburras. Mm -hmm. By the Beastie Boys. Ch -ch 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 check it out. What, well, what's it all about? It's about three the hard way. And just a tale as old as time. You're just going to get us in some triple trouble. <laughs> Shazam! It's here! <laughs> um, and not to be outdone, we of course have the earlier Root Down EP on one of five randomly inserted colored vinyl. Mm -hmm. So uh, you can guess what the colors could be. Wink. And uh, there's five different options here. We've got plenty of copies. So is this first time on vinyl or first reissue in a long time? First reissue in a long time. Limited edition reissue. That's right. And there's two more that we don't have with us right here. Yeah, but they've been delayed due to production problems. So, Paul's Boutique and Ill Communication also coming out respectively on purple and silver. Double LP. Uh, this is the first time <laughs> for me, Dark Side. What? Tom, we did get Insomnium. Mike Viega, I'll check on the Dinosaur Jr. Not 100% sure off the top of my head. Yep, haven't seen him. That doesn't mean anything. My turn or your turn? Uh, I'll go me. Uh, this week also is a continuing of 10 Bands, One Cause. Of course, this is a series of vinyl reissues uh, put out to support a great organization, Gilda's Club of New York City. <laughs> They support uh, people diagnosed with cancer and their caretakers. So uh, all the proceeds from these uh, go towards that great charity. There are 10 albums. They're all pressed on limited pink LPs, and they continue this week with two of them. I've got one here in my hand, Courtney Marie Andrews. May your kindness remain. Uh, there's also a spiritualized release that is out this week. There were two last week. There's a bunch more coming. You can see the complete list of them on our website. Uh, for you metal fans, uh, Sun's new album will be coming out on the 25th on Pink LP as part of this. But uh, they're great, they're limited edition, and you get to do something good while getting some great tunes. So come support them, come pick them up tomorrow. Uh, who was your favorite? My favorite was um, Heather Locklear. I'm going to go with Pacey. It's the Beverly Hills 90210 soundtrack. We're both right. <laughs> I like this guy. Where is he? Right here. That guy. The guy who was in uh, Sharknado? Seasoned Curlies. Yeah, the guy from Sharknado. Oh. Loved him in Sharknado, mm -hmm. of course. That was his first role. Then he did yeah, that Yeah, this is going back. But here it is for all you 90s babies out there growing up. Lit watching the 902 and I was maybe you've been watching the reboot on Netflix. I wouldn't know anything about it. Mm -hmm. But uh, of course, you got Paul Abdul, Color Me Bad, Jeremy Jordan, Vanessa Williams, featuring With? Brian McKnight, Puck and Natty. I don't know who that is. I don't know either. Jeffrey Williams, Shanice, Jody Watley, Kathy There's Dennis. A joke for you. With D Mob or D Mob. Oh, Michael McDonald. Oh, and Shaka Khan, y'all. Uh, Tara Kemp. And of course, Jonathan Davis. Of Corn. Of Corn does the theme <laughs> for Beverly Hills 90210. We should make that happen. We should get Jonathan Davis and John Davis to redo the theme from from Corn or Beverly Hills 90210. Just loosen up your bass strings and you got it. <laughs> but uh, of course, also not featured, and I don't know where they are right now. The Menzingers. Oh, yeah. We're waiting for the Menzingers. It's supposed to come tomorrow. But either way, we'll have it. We've been assured it's been overnighted to us. Hello, Exile, indie mm -hmm. exclusive, mm -hmm. peach vinyl. And what I was looking for but don't see readily at hand here is uh, your boy scored some sweet, sweet tote bags that go along. They say the Menzingers, Hello, Exile, and it says support your local record store right on the bottom of the tote bag. So Thanks, Menzingers. You're welcome, Internet. Thanks, Anti-Epitaph Records. Yeah. That's a slash. Not I'm saying I'm not that I'm anti-epitaph records. I'm very pro. And I'm gonna give you a quick reach around here. Oh. Also out this week, 
Boris. They got a new one. It's called Love Evil. You can give me a reach around next because there's something here for you. Uh, it's a, uh, oh God. It's a, for you love of dream doom, shoegaze, noise, and all things adorable in Japanese. I'm going there in April. You can uh, come get the new Boris. There's one more. Oh, of course. For you. For me. For you. That is, of course, the new one from City in Color. A pill for loneliness. And, uh, of course, Dallas Green and the folk are back. And uh, tomorrow night, 7 p.m., mm -hmm. we're going to do a listening party in the store. The label has generously provided us with free pizza. So come on out. Listen to the new City in Color record. We have an exclusive patch to anybody who buys the album mm -hmm. during mm -hmm. the listening event. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And, uh, of course, it'll be from free pizza. Mm -hmm. Look, whatever sells you win, on it. Win, you know, come win, on. win. Yeah. So pick up the album, get a patch, have a slice, and uh, your Friday night will be pretty nice, huh? That's right. Eves, you're not wrong. Boris, one of the loudest live bands ever. Seen him a couple times. Great live band. Great loud live band. Yeah. So yeah. So uh, all these, of course, as I mentioned at the top of this video, these will all be out tomorrow. That's Friday, October 4th. Uh, we open at 10 a.m. here at Darkside Records, 611 Judges Turnpike in Poughkeepsie. And you can also shop for all these on our website, darksiderecords.com. And, uh... Thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed this video, God, what is happening? If you enjoyed this video, <laughs> uh, give us a subscribe on the YouTube. So give us a follow on the Facebooks. Um, and uh, come get some new music here tomorrow. See you on the bends.